There is an easy calm among construction workers at the Pokwase Interchange and Local Road Project site following alleged inhuman treatment from some expatriate workers. Preliminary investigation by the Amasaman Divisional Police Command revealed no wrongdoing on the part of the expatriate. Peter Kwawadato has the story. The Pokwasi Interchange and Local Roads Project working environment has been relatively calm since its commencement in March 2018. However, a petition by the local union on Monday, January 13, appeared to cast doubt over the future. The petition demanded the repatriation of one of Chinese nationals over alleged repeated assault. The said Chinese, known as Ma, has been accused of assaulting four Guinean workers on the site. The latest incident allegedly occurred on Tuesday, January 7, against an excavator operator, Abubakar Danjuma. The Chinese man was said to have recommended the termination of Danjuma's contract based on safety violations leading to a confrontation. Ma was arrested by the Pokwasi Police Command but was granted bail. According to the Amasaman Divisional Police, two local witnesses accused Danjuma of attacking the Chinese, leading to an exchange between the two. Abubakar Danjuma, according to report, is yet to produce a single witness as demanded by the police. Rather, the local union decided to demand the repatriation of Ma. The resident engineer for the project, engineer Kobna Brimpon, expressed regret over the development. He urged the workers to always resort to dialogue in addressing challenges. Because we do not want any uprising or any you know, counter uh, measures being taken by the Ghanaian workers, such as also assaulting the, the Chinese. No, we are working very well and we want that harmony to be maintained on site. And there's the need for all of us as Ghanaians to be proud to be working on a project such as this. And I must commend you know, the workforce you know, here because... 